Okay, YouTube, just going to make a quick review video of the Guardian Angel Elite. I am not being paid by them uh, to promote this product or anything of that nature. This is just a product that I purchased that I have used in my profession, and I really like it, and I think it's a lifesaver, so I want to share it with you. So this is what I purchased. Um, uh, you got a little adhesive sticker here. You can put your blood type, your name, current medication in case there's an emergency. Or um, if you lose your item, your uh, guardian angel here, you can use that. Hopefully it'll get returned to you. So in the box, we've got the unit itself. We've got a charging cable for it with a micro USB charging port on it to USB, which I use, uh, I plug it into my squad computer. I also, uh, you know, you can plug it into a USB port if you got one of the little charging blocks, things like that. And also in here is a, a clip that you can use. And what happens is this magnet comes off. You can attach this like this and then clip it onto your shirt if you would prefer to use that instead of the magnet setup. Um, in the box also, instruction card, how to turn everything on, operations overlay, emergency on off front LEDs, rear LEDs to power it on, to power it off, USB charging port, work light, and then it's got your run times up above there. 130 hours runtime, uh, first pressed five hours runtime, and third press gives you a 16 hour runtime. And then on the back, safety information it does have the high powerful, very powerful magnets, so keep them away from pacemakers, credit cards, cassettes, floppy disks. Like that's going to happen and a website if you want to order one. So what is it? It is a flashlight. Um, I wear it on my left shoulder while I'm taking notes, writing things down on traffic stops, anything like that. What we have here is the front button. One light, one butt press turns on a red LED light. Two presses, or second press turns on just a white light. And then you also have a dimming feature. So there's low, medium, and high. Press it again. Low, medium, low, medium, and high. Then your front. You've got rear. So we've got LEDs just on the rear of the unit. Flashing red and blue. Hit the rear again, it'll turn it off. You've got forward facing red and blue LEDs, as well as one on the side. Okay. And then you can press the GA, the guardian angel, and that lights up everything. So now we've got front, rear, sides, and a top strobe. And you can even use the dimmer button there. So that's the low setting. And that is what this one does. So I'll, like I said, I'll wear this on my left shoulder. Um, I use it on traffic stops. Um, if we're at like a, a major event or something, you could be in a crowd. Obviously, this would draw the attention of other officers if you needed assistance, anything like that. Pull it off the base right here. Open this up. Got it. That's where the charging port is. It is water resistant. So that's good. Um, put this on this little uh, adhesion a uh, rubber gasket kind of comes with it so that it doesn't spin on your shoulder. So um, like that, it'll spin. 
and if you, this is up against your fabric, it stops it from spinning. So I bought this. Um, a couple other officers at my department really liked it. They ended up buying their own. And then a few weeks later, a few months later, the whole uh, department got them issued to them by the chief and captain. So now I have this one. I don't know what I'll do with it. Probably try to sell it or something. They are, this one was $100. I think $99 is what it retails for. But I am very happy with it and I use it on every traffic stop. Um, and obviously the uh, my coworkers felt that it was um a good idea some of them do uh, some of them wear them some of them don't um i think it's a good idea obviously anything that makes you more visible to traffic um possibly getting hit by a car or anything like that is is going to be a good idea in my book obviously we should all park our cars um, off center of the vehicle we're stopping to give us that safe lane um, but this is just another thing really good really easy to use you know instead of holding a flashlight in your hand now you can just push this, walk up to the vehicle. Um, you've got both your hands free in case you have to use uh, uh, some sort of weapon or anything like that uh, to control the subject if, if things do go crazy um, or go bad. But now your hands are free. You don't have to hold that flashlight unless you, you know, maybe you're one of those who likes using the flashlight uh, for a strike or something like that if you need be. But I personally, I would rather have my hands available instead of having to hold the flashlight and I, this also is very bright it could easily blind a person um, and you don't have to hold on to it so that is the law enforcement version red and blue unit my department got one um, they did not come with these neoprene rubber gaskets but this seems to hold. I haven't had any issues with it falling off. The only thing I have is in my climate, we do uh, typically wear coats in the winter. Um, so then this would be hidden under my coat unless I were to take it off and put it on top of my coat. Um, also, if you're wearing a traffic vest, if you get out on a crash scene and you're putting a traffic vest on. But very heavy duty, very good quality built, um, very strong like I don't you know it's not chintzly made it's not uh I, I'm not worried about that breaking unless somebody directly hits it um you know with something but if it just falls off my shoulder or something like that I don't think it's going to break if it gets run over by a car yeah probably then uh my wife bought me for my birthday another one um I plow snow in the winter and she bought me one I just uh plow snow with my lawnmower my x739 you may have seen in my other video and she bought me a yellow and white one now on this one it came with the strap snap lock mount with magnetic mount and screw on so she bought me this and it looks like it's different than the older model the older version just plastic there this newer version looks like they put a magnet in there so we'll have to see, comes with the two screws for it, some instructions on the back about using it. And I believe this is included, I'm not sure, but I believe this is included in the purchase of this unit. So again, we've got a red light in the front and looks like we just press it again and it turns it off so there is no white light just the red light but we do still have the different brightness settings front lights are just white and then press it again and we got some flashing there we've got our brightness settings so press it once on twice is flashing rear press once and they're on twice and they're flashing and different brightness settings okay let's see yep on the end we got that one LED right there on the end and same for the front so now if you didn't want everything flashing say you just wanted the front flashing or just the rear flashing and then you've got the guardian angel feature 
which this top light flashes. So if you were to fall over, um, you know, something like that, you'd have this one here that would project the light out. Um, I suppose if you had somebody from above who was trying to find you, a helicopter or something, maybe that would be easier to spot than these other ones on the side. Again, the magnet, but no Just the charging cable, no rubber gasket again. So they must have done away with that rubber gasket. Um, but those are the Guardian Angel Elite Series. I highly recommend them. Very durable, very heavy, good quality item. Good luck and stay safe out there.